Sensational. Come here, sweetie. Let me have a moment with you. thousand kisses to you all if you're new here my name is brianna maybell and if you're an oldie coming back then i love you baby for coming back yes click 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 i am so happy that i finally got my hands on some press on nails thank you kiss for making french manicure press ons for my white toenail polish in my room my hair is braided down so you know this is going to be a wig review today i'm reviewing the sensational what lace collection i'm doing a zelina and i got the color 1b of course this comes in a multitude of colors one of my favorites being flamboyage chocolate you'll see that and another wig review coming but right now we're gonna stick to our roots I'm gonna go ahead and take all those freaking tissue papers out of here because we don't need it what just go away and uh, we're gonna go ahead and try this on so I have one clip in the back two clips in the front and then you have those things for the adjustable straps this is a real-life reaction right here guys this is not fake I was like oh bish that's tight okay all right <laughs> because this thing is tight but I'll talk about that later so I'm gonna go ahead and check this wig out. It's supposed to have an invisible lace front look. It's supposed to be a very easy, tossable hairstyle. And um, you know, we're just gonna play with it and I'm done talking. I'm gonna talk to you in the end. Go ahead and enjoy the video. Bye-bye. into the video pop 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 and talk to you about this one thing i just noticed don't mind my thumb because you guys seen it came off right as soon as i started the video talking about me putting on my press on pop right off my hand so i really wanted to do a deep kind of part with this hair because you know i just finished doing the sensational salon if you haven't seen that video go watch it and i didn't want to repeat the same hairstyle because a lot of the wigs i have coming are going to be middle part wigs i'm going to get this new wig and i'm going to do a deep part and it's going to be sexy and it's going to be cute and then I looked at the deep parting space, non-existent whatsoever. I'm not a fan of the parting space. Down the middle, yes. On the sides for deep parts, no. Solana, yes. Zelina, no. All right, that's it. Go back to the video. this video and I say finally with a whole lot of like meaning to it finally finally I'm about to go glue this bitch back on give me a minute we need we need to talk about Zelina okay now with what I wanted to do I wanted to do a deep side part on this way I just did Solana a week ago let me take Zelina and do something different and show the deep side parts because it's what lace right so you're supposed to you know be able to do all these different looks with the same lace and have that illusion that it is your scalp these are in need for this unit all right so i'm going to talk about the cons first and then then i'm going to talk about the pros for me 
this unit it just it just went backwards like you guys didn't move forward you went backwards with this unit okay for the price point i just paid for this wig i think it was like 60 dollars or something i'll have it down below and i paid guys i did not get this one sent to me like 60 dollars for this unit and i know it's not going to last me that long like well like, sensational what you doing as far as the hair itself it is much thicker than Solana. So much thicker than Solana. Um, I feel like they did listen to everybody with asking for more realistic looking units because in all honesty, this makes, this is, this is nice. This is nice. The hair is nice. I like the texture. That's a pro. But for the con, um, it could have had more body. Like you could have did a little bit more body. Like I find myself going like this a lot with this unit only because I'm trying to make up for the fact that even though it was short, when you have a shorter length like that, I expect more body. But then again, not everybody likes big hair. A little bit more body would take care of this little weird, I don't even cause in the part. When I wanted to do a deep part, it would have gave me a little bit more of a wapow, a little bit more of that Ariel, a little bit more of that Jessica Rabbit look that I was trying to do. It would have helped to have more body in the wig. The lace went nice into my skin. But this wig is not big head friendly it might be my friend's friend but it's no friend of mine directly like we friends through a mutual acquaintance i have on a wig grip because it's synthetic i don't have time to be sitting here using my got to be that i use on my uh my actual real hair units trying to lay a synthetic hair down and i'm probably gonna take it off in the next hour or two or after today you know what i mean so i don't feel like i have to always you know glue something down i took out my handy dandy wig grip okay okay and, and don't be judging me because i'm lazy this bad boy She's ready to slide off at any minute. She's ready to what pow. She's ready to slide off my head. Not to, like my wig grip is literally holding her in place and I also didn't want to make it too tight. So really, if you were looking at the inside of my wig and you know where the little things are that helps you adjust it a little bit more, the little tiny hooks that go into the little slits. Here I have it on the outside of the nape with my wig grip and this shit is tight. This, this unit is tight. Send help. It's tight. But as far as that, that's all my, that's really all my cons. So I want to get into the positivities, right? I want to be positive. I want to leave this video on a positive note. Well, I mean, she feels like a synthetica, but she doesn't look fake. I went outside, did the test to see how much shine I had. Not a lot of shine in my opinion. I'm a big fan of the layers in here because like it's, it's perfect for the shape of my face. Like this is all cut to perfection for this to mimic a body for this to mimic like a stylist's secret i feel like they're not revealing too much this this is pretty this is pretty as far as the cuts are concerned i still have a soft lace thank you for the lace i've worked with companies or you know purchased wigs over the years where that lace is so irritating girl like it feels like it's just scraping your skin it feels like you're the cheese and it's the greater and it's just going it's just going against that skin this is such a comfortable lace i said that for the last wig i reviewed from sensational i love the fact that these laces are so comfy um this is supposed to be a hairline illusion lace wig i also forgot to mention this as a con a hair illusion illusion sis you you stretching the truth there this is not an illusion i tried you guys seen the video i tried plucking this hairline i tried plucking the middle which i did pluck a lot um of the middle to make it look more realistic that's a lot of work this is a synthetic wig i want to slap it on and take it off i want to whip it out and whip it in like i don't want to have to do all the work that i do for a frontal unit and i had to do it to make this look the way it does sensational come on help me it says it's supposed to be an undetectable translucent swiss lace for a seamless hairline and natural parting right out of the box okay so i only had to use baby hairs here because obviously i won't be turning my head no way to where you're gonna see on the side of my head i'm missing hair if i had to rate this wig on a scale of one to ten i'd probably give her around an Seven. Would I go buy it again for the price point? Mm, I probably would wait for a minute. I let the heat die down and then I purchase this wig. I'm not saying I wouldn't. Not saying I get it at full price. Like this is a must grab. Because I'm not telling you nothing about a wig, but I ain't telling you too about a wig. You know what I mean? Okay, okay. I mean she's cute. It depends on where you're trying to go. But like, for all the cons, honey. I, 
I hope you guys enjoyed this video anyway. I hope you I hope you like the look. Because either way, she is cute. She is cute, guys. She's giving me something. She's serving her purpose. Make sure you share this video with your friends. You know, tell a friend to tell a friend so we can be friends on the weekends. I have a lot of announcements and a lot of things I want to talk to you guys about in the coming videos. So make sure you pay attention and turn those post notifications on, baby. Especially if you follow me on Instagram. And if you don't, my Instagram handle is the same as my channel name, okay? I did not make it hard for you to find me. Be safe, be happy, and be you. Thank you so much for watching, and I love you all. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>